Over a dozen notable authors from China and Germany gathered at the Chinese Academy of Social Sciences. Organized by the Institute of Foreign Literature, the 2013 Sino-German Literary Forum kicked off with a packed house of intellectuals. The opening remarks were made by Tianying, the chairwoman of the Chinese Writers Association. She emphasized how important it is to open communications between the two countries in order to strengthen and improve the literary scene from a global perspective. It is easy to sit next to each other, but we must remember to talk to each other. As authors and writers, we must keep on discovering this world with an open mind and to learn from each other. Although today's event is about publishing, literature, and its authors, as many of the speakers had mentioned, this is really a bridge-building activity between Germany and China, two countries that both consider each other familiar strangers. And one of the major bridge-builders here are the simultaneous translators. As you can see, many of the audience participants have these headsets where they can listen to their German and Chinese translations instantaneously. And that's an instantaneous connection between the two cultures. And the speakers preceding Tianying echoed the sentiment, stating that although the countries are very far away from each other, literature can bring them closer together. And the guest of honor at the event was Mo Yan, the first Chinese Nobel Prize winner in literature. We had a chance to speak to the novelist before he gave a speech. As an author, my relationship to my works is like a female chicken and her eggs. And the audience today can witness all these chickens who are here to share their eggs. During his speech, Mo Yan shared some of his insights and best practices about what it takes to be a great author. Point number one, staying connected. Point number two, self-reflection. Point number three, get rid of the elitist mentality. As authors, we can't write for the people, and we are not here to preach to people. We can't be elitist because we're not better than the average person. We can only represent ourselves. The Chinese Academy of Social Sciences is an institution directly under the State Council. The Institute of Foreign Literature plans on increasing their cross-cultural events this year. UHU CCTV.